Hi, hope you're all doing fine. In this video, we'll discuss the list of important topics in complete danger. So, entire prosthodontics we divided the entire syllabus into two weeks, right? So, in the first week, we'll be uh, covering only complete denture. In the second week, we'll be covering FPD and RPD. So, in this video, we'll discuss the list of important topics in complete denture, right? And the books for reference include vouchers and Sheldon Winkler, right? So these are the standard textbooks which you can rely upon and these are the books which are prescribed by DCA also in its uh, course syllabus 2007 uh, as per 2007 regulations, right? So coming to the list of important topics in complete denture, in the impression procedures, uh, try to focus on the following list of topics, right? Uh, you can just note down simultaneously the list of important topics, right? So in impression procedures, we have disinfection duration. So various impression uh, materials, uh, various impression techniques and the disinfection protocol right so we have question on disinfection duration of alginate impressions asked in comet 2016 and also we have various questions on muscles related to uh, or uh, which influence various frenal attachments within the oral cavity right so we have a question on masseter muscle asked in comet 2015 a question on mandibular label frenum influenced by which of the following muscles asked in comet 2013 right and also we have a lot many questions on various impression techniques classification like we have mucocompressive technique mucostatic and also selective pressure technique right so asked in comet 2014 and gset 2014 and a lot many questions on stress bearing areas primary secondary stress bearing areas and stress relieving areas in maxilla as well as mandible asked in comet 2014 and aapg 2015 right and uh, various factors affecting the stability of denture asked in pgi 2013 and also the gel time for alginate asked in Ames 2014 and also a question on mean denture bearing area of edentulous maxilla and mandible asked in Comet 2014. And also we have a question on retromolar pad, the components of a retromolar pad, various muscular attachments, uh, presence of glandular tissue, pterygomandibular raphae, etc. asked in AAPG 2015, right? So these are some of the uh, uh, important topics in impression procedures, right? And next, coming to border molding and posterior palatal seal. Uh, we have a question on a single step border molding asked in a ap 2016 and also a question on uh, purpose or functions of posterior palatal seal and also the boundaries of maxillary and mandibular denture asked in ap 2016 right and in jaw relations we, we have questions on hinge axis asked in gset 2014 the rest position of mandible asked in bhu 2012 fissures angle bennett angle so we have questions on these uh, the definitions of the angles right asked in bhu 2012 we have question on face bow its functions asked in ap 2013 and ap 2015 and lot many questions on working and non-working condyle the differences between them asked in 2000 uh, i mean uh, g set 2014 and also we have a question on configuration of palatal vault right a v-shaped palatal vault or u-shaped palatal vault and its influence on lateral stability of denture asked in gset 2014 and we have a lot many questions on various methods for recording centric relations like right? we have these static methods functional methods intraoral and extraoral methods we have a classification and we need to go through that topic in elaborate manner right and also a question on a freeway space asked in comet 2014 right so these are some of the questions in jaw relations some of the topics which you can focus on right and coming to teeth setting and articulators so we have a lot many questions on uh, articulator uh, classification various types of articulators and their specifications and also uh, mainly the differences between archon type of articulators and non archon type of articulators right and we, to be uh, more specific we have questions on hano h2 articulator asked in mhpg set 2016 Various factors affecting overbite overjet relations of anterior teeth asked in BHU 2012. As I said, Archon non Archon articulators asked in BHU 2012 and various previous AAPG papers. And a lot many questions on curve of, spli uh, curve of P, Wilson, Monson, uh, Bonville's curve, right? So, already we discussed all this in oral path in, um, uh, in the starting uh, section of our uh, course curriculum where we discussed about various uh, in occlusion. In in specific in uh, dental anatomy and oral histology we had discussed few of such points which we came across in wheeler 
this as well right so curve of speed wilson monson bonville's curve etc and we have a lot many questions from them in previous aims papers as well and lot many questions on phonetics and their orientation and their influence on and their influence on the arrangement of teeth so this is very very important so phonetics in orientation of anterior teeth uh, like we have labial sounds labio dental sounds alveolar sounds sibilants dental sounds arched and comet neat kerala various various entrances right so you need to focus on a phonetics in orientation of anterior teeth and also have questions on base plate wax uh, types of base plate wax we have three types right based on their ability of flow at a given temperature asked in a neat 2000 13 and also we have questions on classifications of articulators right so these are some of the topics in teeth setting and articulators and coming to various other miscellaneous topics like we have questions on overdenture mainly the advantages disadvantages indications right so we have questions on these areas in overdenture in comet 2009 various tissue conditioners asked in k set 2009 also we have questions on advantages and disadvantages of immediate uh, or Dentures asked in Comet 2008, PGA 2005, Karnataka, various entrances. And also we have various questions on implants, the position between uh, two implants ideally, what is osseointegration, integration, etc. asked in KSET 2007. And uh, various other topics like uh, various materials used in fabrication of maxillofacial processes, frequently asked in Comet, previous AAPG papers. And also we have questions on remounting, lab remounting as well as clinical remounting. Asked in PGA 2014 and also the resorption pattern of a mandible resorption pattern seen in mandible as well as maxilla the direction of resorption asked in comet and various other entrances as well and also indications of complete denture relining asked in GZ 2014 and denture cleaning powder the composition a main components of denture cleaning powder uh, asked in AAPG 2014 and also we have frequently questions from uh, problems during denture insertion right so these are some of the uh, list of important topics which you can focus on while you're preparing for complete denture and make sure that you have standard references like either Boucher or a Sheldon Winkler right so keep these things in mind and in the next subsequent video we'll try to cover list of important topics in FPD as well as RPD right hope it's clear